a full body workout then some abs and then did hill sprints I did five hill sprints they were like 200 meters and then I did 20 kettlebell swings in between and now it's time for my post workout protein shake so I've got around about 300 to 400 milliliters of unsweetened almond milk then I've got my golden whey mint choc chip protein powder so I've got a scoop of that to go in oh I've forgotten the ice cream <laughs> and then I'm gonna put in some ice cream around about two scoops of vanilla so let's put this in and then yeah just whiz it all together and it tastes amazing <laughs> So week two, day two, and today I'm having an alternative lunch to what I normally have. I think I showed you in last week vlog, last week's vlog, um, my salmon salad, and today I'm going to have a chicken and pesto salad. So I'm going to show you how I make it. Basically, I'm using the same house salad, M&S pot, um, and then I'm going to butterfly some chicken, fry that either side in a frying pan, shot that in the oven for a couple of minutes maybe a little bit more just to finish it off and then I'm gonna add some pesto on top I'm really excited and I'm just trying to get through my lemon water before lunch so let's grab the camera and show you how I make it change up my breakfast I'm gonna have some healthy kind of healthy pancakes I'm gonna be doing a lot today so I think I need some kind of a substance to last me throughout the day so yeah I'm gonna show you how I make them
Friday and I wasn't going to film because we're actually having a dinner party and I thought you know what I'll keep it in because you know since being in lockdown we haven't been able to see anyone and now that the restrictions are getting better or, or easing off slightly um my family haven't seen will's family so we're having a little get together tonight and yeah i'm filming it because you're not gonna get a perfect month where you don't do anything and you can consistently eat well and stay healthy you are gonna have events that come up and maybe try and put you off your progress but i've been in the gym today i've eaten really healthy and then i'm gonna make sure i eat really healthy tomorrow but I am going to enjoy myself tonight. I'm going to have some wine. And I have made a roulade. Look at this. She is slightly thicker on one end because one side rose slightly higher than the other. Um, but I thought it'd be fun to decorate this with you guys. Um, this is a chocolate and raspberry roulade. today completely forgot to vlog saturday and sunday sunday was just my chill day didn't do anything on sunday apart from watch the formula one and go to my niece's birthday so i may have had a cupcake then but i, I halved it with will to make it myself feel a little bit better and then on saturday i did a really intense workout to try and combat friday's um meal but oh, it, was, it was such a good meal guys we did biryani my mum did this scallop dish um will's mum did gorgeous little yorkshire puddings with beef and horseradish and then salmon pancakes <gasps> and then my roulade let me know in the comments down below what you thought about my roulade it was really good it was so yummy but yeah it's been a naughty week too but as it's Monday, I'm going to just start straight away into week three phase, which is no snacking at all. And I'm going to try my hardest and not have anything kind of like desserty kind. Because on a night, I've been having like little go bars, which are like brownie, like tiny little 90 calorie brownies after dinner. And that would be like my little chocolate fix for the day. But I'm going to try and go without that and have maybe a chocolate fix on Friday night. And that's it for week three and week four. So no salad dressing, no tomato sauce or mayo, nothing like that. Everything's going to be really plain. So I thought I'd show you my breakfast today. And I'm actually going to have like kind of like a fruit bowl. I've got raspberries. Um, strawberries and a large banana and then I'm going to top that off with Greek style fat free Greek style yogurt and then I'm also going to add a little bit of birch to it because as I said I'm not going to be snacking today at all um, and I'm going in the gym later on so I kind of want to make sure I can keep going to lunch and then have a nice lunch and then keep going for the gym and then dinner so I'm going to grab that birch now and show you so this is deliciously Ella Bircher muesli with apple and raspberry. It's my favourite one. Um, you can have it, just the Bircher and milk and some fruit. I love that as well. But today I just want a little bit of sprinkling to it. I'm trying to be really, really good. So let me bring you down to my other little spot and I'll show you how I make it.
guys, so excuse me looking a bit like a mess. I've literally just jumped out of the shower and popped on my PJs. It's around about half 11. <laughs> and I had a late night gym sesh because I was waiting in for a certain package. <laughs> my exchange finally came and I'm so excited to show her to you. Um, so expect a unboxing on Thursday and I've actually got another designer package coming tomorrow. So it's gonna be a double unboxing on Thursday. So make sure you check that out. But yeah, I've just been in the gym. I did um, like an introductory workout to week three because this is gonna be like the end of this part two vlog. Um, and oh my goodness guys, it was so hard. I did 15 minutes. 30 seconds on, 30 seconds off, then into a full blown workout, then into a 10 minute ab workout and I am so tired. Um, but I wanted to do a bit of skincare because I feel like I haven't really sat down properly the last couple of weeks and really exfoliated and had a bit of a detox. So I'm gonna do that today, um, well tonight, <laughs> nearly tomorrow, and um, just make myself feel a bit better. Okay, so I'm gonna use my soothing cleanser oil and yeah this is just really good I love to use this every day regardless and this is really nice and cleansing I feel like I haven't sat down and really pampered my skin in so long then I'm gonna take a nice hot funnel or oh, it was hot before I started rambling away <laughs> a warm funnel <laughs> damp should I say and just taking that over the skin I think I'm gonna put on a mask now um this one I love it's called instant detox it's five minutes on your face which at this point when I do want to just get into bed and go to sleep this is perfect I'm just gonna put, pop this on my nose But I'm hoping you're enjoying these vlogs, guys. Let me know in the comments if you think I should do a weekly vlog. Um, let me know if you'd like me to do that whilst I'm in Portugal as well. Um, carry on the holiday kind of vlogs. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna leave this on for five minutes and then I will come back to you. Okay guys, so I'm just gonna take this off and hope it's all done wonders on my face. Okay, to finish off, I'm gonna add some treatment lotion from Bobbi Brown. Just massaging that all in. Some hydrating water fresh cream, again, from Bobbi Brown. I'm only needing a small amount. I've started applying my moisturizer like this putting it in the center of my palm and working it into the skin i feel like it saves you using excess product and it helps you get the moisturizer everywhere and then my lip balm is in my car so i can't use that so i'm going to use a bit of my eye cream um again this is hydrating eye cream from Bobbi Brown. I'm gonna tap a little bit on here, a little bit on there, and just uh, applying that to the lips as well. I think this is the first time in probably two weeks that I've actually sat down to do my nightly skincare routine, which is just crazy. Um, I'm now gonna add this Renite mask just to boost my skin. Do I have one open? Because I feel, oh no, this is open. Um, just to give my skin just an extra boost, because I haven't done this in a while, and I'm only taking a pea size amount. Um, does say on the back not to add too much, just a thin layer. Oh, that smells amazing. 
Okay guys, and that concludes this holiday prep part two. Let me know in the comments down below what you think of this holiday prep series. I hope you guys are enjoying it. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button, give this video a massive thumbs up, join the family if you haven't already, we would love to have you. And yeah, don't forget to stay tuned for unboxings coming on Thursday. Bye for now.